Amid cracking explosions, a Ukrainian serviceman gestures for a car to stop and helps an injured woman onto the passenger seat. Here in Lysychansk, Russian and Ukrainian forces are engaged in an artillery battle, seeing houses and cars go up in flames. The city is next to Severodonetsk, the current focus of Russia's advance, where hundreds are thought to be blockaded inside this chemical plant. On Saturday, the regional governor said shelling of the facility had caused a fire and oil leak. According to Moscow-backed separatist, 300 to 400 Ukrainian soldiers are inside, while Kiev says there are 800 people, including civilians. Severodonetsk and Lysychansk are the last major pockets of the eastern Luhansk region that are still under Ukrainian control. In the country's south, Moscow's forces occupying Kherson were shown awarding Russian passports to residents, a move dismissed by Ukraine's president. Volodymyr Zelensky said Ukrainian forces had begun to recapture parts of the Kherson region and were gaining ground in Zaporizhia.